Hello everybody, welcome back to EU4, I'm Paradox Gamer, playing Trade Hegemon on Twitch. And we are in a war with Castile. Unfortunately, neither of us is the war leader, so <clears throat> it's probably going to be status quo in this war. I might try to uh, get Soria and Murcia by sieging them out. Yeah, so I need to get out of here. Uh, let's go this way and take these guys up that way. We also got a loan we can repay. There we go. All right. And I'm hoping for a little bit of French help because they got things under control up here. Actually, the war might end soon, so. And already the uh, Castilians have more regiments than I do. So Rhea is hills though. Okay, they're coming for me. Um, what kind of leader do they have? Three shark. Same as me. They're tech three. And I'm tech four. So I got a little advantage there, plus I got the hills and maybe even a river. Mare Beast is now following. Thank you, Mare Beast, and thanks for all the comments. Let me just check if there's a river from Quenza. Yep. So get I get river and hills. Um, so I'm just gonna let these guys engage on the 23rd and then I'm gonna reinforce. Some of the French coming down. Okay, JJ Crip, see you later. It's not your kind of game. Ah, uh, they stopped. Got some French uh, coming down there. I think I'm taking these guys around. Like that. <laughs> they're gonna get caught. Sorry, they're gonna get caught, the Bourbonese. Bye bye. And no, I'm not gonna go in there. Okay, they are going to Navarra. No, I thought so. Oh, they're moving north. Perfect. Ah, oh, they're coming back again. Uh, let's get the uh, 50 Diplo. I'm not sure what they're trying to do here. Alright, this time they're moving all the way to Armagnac and Perigord. Perfect. Okay. Now they're, now they're coming back. Here comes the French. I think I will initiate that battle then in Aragon. Leave a siege, go in there. Consulate of the sea. It's going very well. We won that battle. And the French are coming down to help me now. Exonic is now following. Thank you, Exonic. Hope you enjoy the uh, stream today. We had a little uh, problems in the beginning <laughs> with the game problems, plus a crash. So uh, <clears throat> we got our hands full here. Well, the Naples have landed in Murcia, which is my uh, my claim. That's very handy. So I am actually seizing down those two claims that I have. And so yeah, I might be lucky enough to get those. We'll see. In any case, the uh, Castilians are moving 
south here with 13 regiments. Let's see where they're headed. They're headed straight for me. I can hold my own until the uh, French arrives. No, they uh, decide to go somewhere else. All right, I could also chase down these regiments here. That's uh, nine regiments I could uh, wipe out of the game. Because I think these guys are going to engage with the French somewhere around there. All right, so let's take um, the one without the leader. Send him all the way down there. Keep that guy in Aragon. Okay, we got a fight there. Should I help out? Let's see, the French are um, the attackers in hills. And they have a better leader, the Castilians. I could go to Prunero and then prey on if the Castilians win the battle. <clears throat> I'll go in and finish them off myself. Looks like the Castilians <coughs> are actually losing. Why am I taking loans all the time? What's going on here? Three point five three. Okay, that's um, probably because I need to consolidate some troops. Why do I have mercenaries? I never bought any mercenaries. I got three uh, cavalry mercenaries. Did I start with those? Or was that an event? Okay, no wonder I'm losing money then. Okay, let's just lose the money for now. So we can beat down their regiments. Yeah, we stack wipe them. <clears throat> very, very handy. And they also lost up here. So let's go that way. They will probably go in the same direction. So if I stand in Cordoba, take these guys to Quenza. Oh, they're moving very, very fast. I might be able to stack wipe these guys as well. Yeah, I have a lot of expensive cav. I bought at the beginning. No, I never bought any cavalry. I only bought infantry. So some something has happened. I'll get rid of them shortly. Let, let's just get um, let's stack wipe these Spanish first. Okay, they are entering in Toledo. I think I'll get there before they arrive. Stack wipe. Very, very nice. Alright. And we got the French coming down as well. How are we doing in the north? We're doing very, very well. Um, the Austrians with Liege in that wall will probably peace out at some point. So I'm gonna help with uh, with the sieges. Take these guys up there, and these guys up there, and then I'm gonna lose that cab because that's just too expensive for me right now. Bye bye. I should help on my finances plus eleven. <laughs> really? That was a big deal. Alright, I'm just gonna let the uh, Castilians um, produce regiments. That's fine, because they will they will um, reduce their manpower and they will be killed anyway somewhere. So I'm not gonna go out and chase them. I'm just gonna concentrate on these two provinces, and when we get those, oh, they have another stack here. 
maybe from Africa and they have another four coming in there <clears throat> yeah they must have been trapped in Africa maybe all right these guys are going to Jain but I don't th think they will attack me no they're just gonna move north and eventually they'll be caught by by the French somewhere They're just moving around. They can combine into a, a 10 stack. Three more coming up here. The Emperor has enacted a reform. That's fine. Okay, they're gonna go in here. Yeah, and then the French will react. I could help. Well, I'm not gonna do that. You Pope. Where are they going? Cantabria. Alright, let's check. Uh... Oh, I did? I did select uh, mercenaries by mistake. Okay. You can backseat that, that's not a problem. That's clearly a. Uh, a mistake. You do th things like that when you're streaming. Um, I do that all the time because you got so many things going on. Yeah. So you can you can comment that, guys. No problem. See, now I have lots of money. I can I can even repay back that loan. Yeah. Right, so 4.77. Uh, yeah, let's just uh, save up some money then. More French units arriving. And how are we doing on those sieges? Mercia, 7%, and Soria, 35 Once we get those two, I'll just continue sieging out whatever I can. But I don't think I'll get anything. Uh, from a peace deal. The only chance you have when you're a, a lesser partner is if you actually have a claim on stuff or a core, of course. Um, let's go to Madrid. And then there's a chance that you can get something out of the war. And it's not guaranteed, obviously. Should we just take these guys out without morale? Oh, I was too slow. Well, it's still low on morale, though. So let's let's try. Let's grasslands. There is a river, though. Stack wipe. That was worth it. I think there's another. Um, there was another stack going down this way that we can stack wipe. Yeah, that's the one. Let's just take that as as well. Bye bye. Uh, not a stack wipe though. Let's go back to Madrid. Alright, Austria has peaced out. Let's check it out up here. Um, they have taken Breda and Brabant. They have released um, Brabant. Brabant. Three provinces. And Luxembourg, they have released Luxembourg as well. Yeah, I think that's it. So, Burgundy lost those four provinces, and now France is getting sieged. Although they do have um, lots of troops in the area, so they'll they'll fight those. All right, it'll just mean that um, the war will be going on for a lot longer. Let's move to Almeria. Seeks that out. It's gonna watch my main power. Also, I think I can take a uh, national idea. Yeah, I can. Right. So, what are we gonna pick? With uh, having in mind that this is the trade hegemon, uh, we need to go east. 
I'm thinking maritime. Because we are gonna need a, a good navy over there. I'll leave that uh, a while, you guys can comment what you want. Siege Andalusia and hope France give it to you. Um, yeah, that could be... Uh, I am sitting Almeria. Madrid? No, they're not going to give me that. That's true. Yeah, we can try Granada. Oh, you mean the province of Andalusia? No, I don't think they will give me that. I will go to Granada anyway. I can get my um, advice back. Let's see what we got here. We got the national tax guy. Alright, we can pick him. Now they're landing with another two regiments. That's almost too good to be true. Let's take him out. Oh, now they're four. Alright, let's just leave it there then. How much attrition am I taking in here? 1% and 1%, that's fine. The Castilian manpower has to be depleted. Let's check it out. Score comparison. <clears throat> I got 7,000 left. We can see the French engagement down here is a little bit less. Obviously because of the Burgundians in the north. They have shifted troops up there. That is to be expected, but they still have a healthy amount of troops. Okay, they're gonna siege back Soria. Alright, I think I'm gonna take and destroy these two regiments here. If possible. I'm too slow. The AI is always moving so fast. He's consolidating his troops in Soria. Oh, and the French are gonna take it. Alright, so let's go back down south. They'll probably, uh, if they're not stack wiped, they will flee south. Okay, they're stack wiped. Stack wipe. Oh, they gave me Quenza. That's very nice. I wonder why they don't give me the, these two. Oh, I think it's safe to say that uh, things are under control here. Let's go down that way. Alright, let's check the north. How is it going up there? Diplo is always good, but trade hegemon screams trade ideas. Um, well, not necessarily. Trade hegemon is about sniping those three provinces. I just need three provinces in the east, and I just need to snipe them. So it's, not, it's actually not a game about trade. It's a game about getting those provinces. So I don't agree. I don't think it's it's a trade will be a good thing. I gotta go military somehow, and uh, so my my idea is to uh, get my military tech up as high as possible, and then then take maritime ideas so I can hold my own in the Indian Ocean. 
But we can let we can leave it for a little bit. See what you guys think. All right, in the north here, Bourgogne has fallen. The capital that's always a good sign. And I think they got uh, things under control. But there's a lot of uh, provinces to be seated down. And the best thing about this war is the depletion of the uh, Castilian manpower, obviously. And I really hope I can get something out of the war. Some provinces. But it's not, it's not for me to decide. The Macius expansion and then offensive. Expansion? Why would you want expansion? National tax, build cost, yearly inflation reduction. Well, that, well, that was the economy. Um, col I don't need a colonist. I don't need merchants. I don't need global settler increase. I don't, th I don't see why expansion. Maritime and expansion. Okay, now we're talking. Maritime, I agree. Still don't agree about expansion, though. I think I'd rather have you like humanist, so I don't have to convert all those uh, Sunni uh, provinces that I take. Anyway, that's the end of this uh, episode. Thank you so much for watching, and see you next time. Bye bye.